All right, I'm going to use this face. It's of a sculptor friend of mine. By I, Her name is Aya. And uh, I see the structure of the smile, and it's perfect for what I want to do on this piece here. And so I'm going to use it. Now, she's Oriental. She's Japanese. But the smile does give me the clue on how a smile is constructed. And so I'm going to apply that. What happens is she's smiling. It draws in the sides of the mouth. Yeah, that works nice. Time to play with some clay. That really worked out nice. I'm going to make the cheek just a little more puffy above the uh, corners of the smile. Because the cheeks would have a reaction to that action. Remember, for every action, there's a reaction. That's a law that was devised by somebody back in the 1700s or 1600s, I think. They discovered that uh, for every action, there's a reaction. If you wonder why I'm taking so long on this uh, smile, you know, I'm not comparing it. Can't compare it. Yeah, I'm not comparing myself to him. But Leonardo da Vinci spent years on the painting of the Mona Lisa. A smile, no matter how subtle, is important. All right, I'm going to start doing the ear. I figured better to do it here while the uh, 
head is on the uh, stand so I can work on it a little more closely. All right, I'm going to add a little Ronsonol to the face to uh, smooth out those areas that need to be smoothed out. As I've said before, there's a property in, or a chemical in Ronsonol that uh, kind of melts the plastiline clay a little. As you can see, I had eyebrows. I don't know if I'm going to keep them, though. It looks a little harsh. I'm just going to reattach her head to the body. Tomorrow, I'll work on her neck so that uh, it becomes more permanent. And uh, the shoulders and all that stuff. tilt her head just a little like that her neck will be exposed so uh, I need to have some detailing in that uh, the neck muscles All right, good night, everybody. I'll see you uh, next time. When we continue creating If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.